The Auster Valley or Val d'Aster, French, Valle d'Oster, Vale d'Aster Street, Vale d'E Street, or Val d'Oster, Arpeton, Val d'Uta, is a mountainous semi-autonomous region in northwestern Italy. It is bordered by Rhone Alps, France to the west, Valle, Switzerland to the north, and the region of Piedmont to the south and east covering an area of 3,263 square kilometers and with a population of about 128,000 it is the smallest, least populous, and least densely populated region of Italy. It is the only Italian region that has no provinces. Provincial administrative functions are provided by the regional government. The region is divided into 74 comuni. Italian and French are the official languages, though much of the native population also speak Valdotan, a dialect of Arpitan. As their home language, about half of the population can speak all three languages. The regional capital is Auster. Geography the Auster Valley is an alpine valley which with its tributary valleys includes the Italian slopes of Mont Blanc, Monte Rosa, Gran Paradiso and the Matterhorn. Its highest peak is Mont Blanc. Climate The region is very cold in the winter, especially when compared with other places in the Western Alps. This is probably due to the mountains block in the mild winds from the Atlantic Ocean. Places on the same altitude in France or western Switzerland are not as cold as the Auster Valley. The Auster Valley may be divided into different climatic zones. The Dorabel T Valley, between 300 and 1,000 meters above sea level, has the mildest climate in the region, with a typical oceanic climate. The winters are mild, even milder than the Po Valley, but are usually wet and foggy. Snow is frequent only during January and February, but the foggy season, which starts in late October, lasts until May. The temperature average for January is between minus 1 degree Celsius and 3 degrees Celsius. The summers are mild and usually rainy. Temperature averages in July are between 17 degrees Celsius and 20 degrees Celsius. The main towns in this area are Auster, St. Vincent, Châtillon and Saar. Due to the occidental position at the Alpine Arc, the climate classified as CFB may extend to relatively high places, especially near the French border, which receives mild oceanic wind, so it's possible to find locations at 1500 or even 1900 meters high with the same CFB climate, but the temperatures are lower, around minus 2 degrees Celsius in the winter and 15 degrees Celsius in the summer, with mist throughout the year. The valleys that lie are around 1300 meters high, depending on the geomorphology, develop a humid continental climate. Although with mild winter temperatures for this kind of climate, similar to the temperatures of the Norwegian fjords, winter temperatures average around minus 3 degrees Celsius or minus 4 degrees Celsius, and summers between 13 degrees Celsius and 15 degrees Celsius. The snow season starts in November and lasts until March. Mist is common during the morning from April until October. The main communities in this area are Grissany St. John in January and 13.8 degrees Celsius in July, Brusson and Grissany La Trinite. The valleys above 1600 meters usually have a cold continental climate. In this climate the snow season is very long, as long as 8 or 9 months at the highest points. During the summer, mist occurs almost every day. These areas are the wettest in the Western Alps. Temperatures are low, between minus 7 degrees Celsius and minus 3 degrees Celsius in January, and in July between 10 degrees Celsius and 13 degrees Celsius. In this area is the town of Reims Notre Dame, which may be the coldest town in the Western Alps and where the winter average temperature is around minus 7 degrees Celsius. Other towns with this climate are Chami, Roy Savinia, Bionas and Grissini La Trinite. Areas between 2,000 meters and 3,500 meters usually have a tundra climate, where every month has an average temperature below 10 degrees Celsius. This climate may be a kind of more severe cold oceanic climate, with a low summer average but mild winters, sometimes above minus 3 degrees Celsius.
especially near lakes, or a more severe cold continental climate, with a very low winter average. Temperature averages in Pie and Rosa, at 3,400 meters high, are minus 11.6 degrees Celsius in January and 1.4 degrees Celsius in July. It is the coldest place in Italy where the climate is verifiable. In the past, above 3,500 meters, all months were having an average temperature below freezing, with a perpetual frost climate. In recent years though there was a rise in temperatures. See as an example the data for Pie and Rosa. History. The first inhabitants of the Auster Valley were Celts and Ligures, whose language heritage remains in some local place names. Rome conquered the region from the local Salasso around 25 BC and founded Augusta Praetorius Alessorum to secure the strategic mountain passes and they went on to build bridges and roads through the mountains. Thus, the name Vale de Rasta literally means Valley of Augustus. After the Romans, the valley preserved traditions of autonomy, reinforced by its geographical isolation, though it was loosely held in turns by the Goths and then by the Burgundians in the 5th century, followed by the Franks who overran the Burgundian kingdom in 534. It was also ruled by the Byzantines between 553 and 563 and then by the Lombards between 568 and 575 before the Franks finally conquered the area. At the division among the heirs of Charlemagne in 870, the Auster Valley formed part of the Lotharingian Kingdom of Italy. In a second partition a decade later, it formed part of the Kingdom of Upper Burgundy, which was joined to the Kingdom of Arles, all with few corresponding changes in the population of the virtually independent fiefs in the Auster Valley. In 1031 to 1032 Humbert I of Savoy, the founder of the House of Savoy, received the title Count of Auster from Emperor Conrad II of the Franconian line and built himself a commanding fortification at Bard. Saint Anselm of Canterbury was born in Auster in 1033 or 1034. The region was divided among strongly fortified castles and in 1191 Thomas I of Savoy found it necessary to grant to the communes a charter des franchises that preserved autonomy, rights that were fiercely defended until 1770, when they were revoked in order to tie Auster more closely to Piedmont, but which were again demanded during post-Napoleonic times. In the mid-13th century Emperor Frederick II made the county of Auster a duchy, and its arms charged with a lion rampant were carried in the Savoy arms until the reunification of Italy in 1870. During the Middle Ages the region remained strongly feudal, and castles, such as those of the Chalant family, still docked the landscape. In the 12th and 13th centuries, German-speaking Walser communities were established in the Lys Valley, and some communes retain their separate Walser identity even today. The region remained part of Savoy lands, with the exceptions of French occupations from 1539 to 1563, later in 1691, then between 1704 and 1706. As part of the Kingdom of Sardinia, it joined the New Kingdom of Italy in 1861. It was also ruled by the First French Empire between 1800 and 1814. During French rule, it was part of her Auster arrondissement in Dois department. Under Mussolini, a forced program of Italianization, including the translation of all toponyms into Italian and population transfers of Italian-speaking workers from the rest of Italy into Auster, fostered movements towards separatism. Many Valdostans chose to emigrate to France and Switzerland. The region gained special autonomous status after the end of World War II. The province of Auster ceased to exist in 1945. Economy The Auster Valley remained agricultural and pastoral until the construction of hydroelectric dams brought metalworking industry to the region. Agriculture has become increasingly specialized, the region retaining only a small output of cereals, potatoes and fruit. Wines of high quality are produced in small quantities. 
All are entitled to the Denominazione di Origine Controllata label. Animal feed crops supply the region's dairy herds, some 40,000 head in 2000, which are pastured in the high Alps during the summer period. The region's cheeses are renowned throughout Italy. Virtually no other form of stock rearing is practiced. Tourism is one of the strongest points of the region's economy. The valley's natural beauty. Its peaceful atmosphere in summer and snow in winter have allowed the development of a flourishing tourism industry centered on winter sports, most famously at Cormaia and Savinia. The Upper Auster Valley is the traditional southern starting point for the tracks, and later roads, to lead over some of the great alpine passes. The road through the Great St. Bernard Pass leads to Martigny Valley, and the road through the Little St. Bernard Pass leads to Bourg St. Maurice, Savoie. Today Auster is joined to Chamonix in France by the Mont Blanc Tunnel, a road tunnel on the European Route E25 running underneath the mountain. Demographics The population density of Auster Valley is by far the lowest of the Italian regions. In 2008, 38.9 inhabitants per square kilometer were registered in the region, whereas the average national figure was 198.8. Though the region has extensive uninhabitable areas of mountain and glacier, with a substantial part of the population living in the central valley, migration from tributary valleys has now been stemmed by generous regional support for agriculture and tourist development. The population is growing slowly but steadily. Negative population growth since 1976 has been more than offset by immigration. The region has one of Italy's lowest birth rates, with a rising average age. This, too, is partly compensated by immigration, since most immigrants arriving in the region are younger people working in the tourist industry. Between 1991 and 2001, the population of Auster Valley grew by 3.1%, which is the highest growth among the Italian regions. With a negative natural population growth, this is due exclusively to positive net migration. Between 2001 and 2011, the population of Auster Valley grew by a further 7.07%. As of 2006, the Italian National Institute of Statistics ISTAT estimated that 4,976 foreign-born immigrants live in Auster Valley equal to 4.0% of the total regional population. The Valdotan population and their language dialects have been the subject of some sociological research. Culture, cuisine The cuisine of Auster Valley is characterized by simplicity and revolves around robust ingredients such as potatoes, polenta, cheese and meat, and rye bread. Many of the dishes involve fontina, a cheese with PDO status, made from cow's milk that originates from the valley. It is found in dishes such as the superlave poilonense. Other cheeses made in the region are toma and ceris. Fromazzo has been produced locally since the 15th century and also has PDO status. Regional specialities, besides Fontina, a Mozzetta, Valle d'Osta la Darnard, Valle d'Osta Jamban de Bosses, and a black bread. Notable dishes include carbonade, consisting of salt-cured beef cooked with onions and red wine served with polenta, breaded veal cutlets called costale, tutians, salt-cured cows udder that is cooked and sliced, and steak a la valdotaine, a steak with croutons, ham and melted cheese. Wine growing notable wines include two white wines from Morgek, a red wine blend from Arvia, and a gamay. Languages The Auster Valley was the first government authority to adopt modern French as the official language in 1536, three years before France itself. Italian and French are nowadays the region's official languages and are used for the regional government's acts and laws. Though Italian is much more widely spoken in everyday life, and French is mostly spoken in cultural life, school education is delivered equally in both Italian and French so that everyone who went to school in Auster Valley can speak French to at least it, a medium-high level. The regional language is a dialect of Franco-Provençal called Valdotan.
It is spoken as native tongue and a second language by 68,000 residents, about 58% of the population. According to a poll taken by the Foundation Emil Chanwu in 2002, the residents of the villages of Grisani St. John, Grisani La Trinite and Izimi, in the Lys Valley, speak two dialects of Walser German origin called Titch and Twachu respectively. Government and Politics Gallery the prehistoric site near Chenel Castle, Mojovet, rich in petroglyph, male alpine ibex, Mount Castor, Effie Acute Castle, 